Tool Steel. Tool steel refers to any steel that is hardened and used in tooling applications. They are steels used to make tools and dies for cutting, forming, and bending operations. These steels are distinguished by their hardness, resistance to wear, toughness, and resistance to softening at high temperatures. Thus, tool steel is usually used in high-impact applications and environments. There are seven main types or grades of tool steel they are 1. Water hardening tool steel 2. Shock resisting tool steel 3. Mold tool steel 4. Hot work tool steel 5. Cold work tool steel 6. High speed tool steel 7. Special purpose tool steel Water hardening tool steel Water hardening tool steel also known as W grades tool steel this type of tool steel contains high carbon steel with high hardness. They are high carbon steel that requires water quenching which is produced at a low cost. The name derives from the fact that all steels in this group are water quenched. Water hardened tool steel has a carbon content ranging between 0.5 to 1%, and small amounts of other elements like molybdenum, manganese, etc. can be added to the steel to improve its applications. The low cost of production compared to other kinds of tool steel makes it a popular choice for many basic applications, although they are not suitable for working at elevated temperatures. The high carbon contents of water-hardened tool steel make them brittle and hard when compared to other tool steels. The water quenching may result in cracks and warping more often than oil quenching or air hardening. Some common applications of W-grade tool steel include cutting tools, cutlery, embossing tools, reamers, cold heading dies, lathe tools, etc. Shock resisting tool steel. Shock resisting tool steel also known as S-grade tool steel is developed to have high level impact resistance and they are remarkably strong. This group contains low carbon and has a very high toughness value. They have low abrasion resistance due to the low carbon content. The high shock resistance and good hardenability are provided by chromium tungsten, silicon molybdenum, and silicon manganese alloying. These properties make S-grade tool steel ideal for producing blacksmith chisels, jackhammer bits, clutch parts, hot and cold shearing blades, grippers, chipper knives, etc. Mold tool steel. Mold tool steel is also known as P-type tool steel with an excellent mix of toughness, corrosion, hardness, wear, and tear resistance. Tool steels under this category also have high impact strength and are easy to polish. The main alloying elements in the mold tool steels are chromium and nickel. Mold tool steel is used to manufacture different kinds of molds including cold punching mold, hot forging die, die casting mold, etc. They are also ideal for companies that use the process of extrusion and injection molding to produce plastic. Using this type of tool steel to produce mold ensures durability and reliability. Hot work tool steel. Hot work tool steels also known as H-grade tool steels are tool steels used for working materials at high temperatures. They are capable of withstanding high abrasion, heat and pressure conditions for performing processes such as forming, shearing and punching of metals at high temperatures of 480 degrees Celsius to 750 degrees Celsius. The type of tool steel in this category usually has a carbon content of 0.6% but has a high content of other alloying elements. This enables them to keep their characteristics, high hardness and toughness, while working at high temperatures for long periods due to the creation of more carbides. Based on the percentage of alloying elements used, there are three main alloying elements in this category, molybdenum, tungsten, and chromium. With these elements, they are grouped into three types. Molybdenum type tool steel. It is a hot work tool steel that has a high molybdenum content. This type of tool steel has high wear resistance and stability. Tungsten type tool steel. This type of tool steel contains 9 to 18% tungsten and 2 to 6% chromium. Tungsten hot work tool steel is brittle and has excellent heat resistance. Chromium type tool steel. This type has 3 to 5% chromium and other elements like tungsten, molybdenum are less than 5%. This type is the most used hot work tool steel type. Hot work tool steels are utilized in processes such as pressure die casting, extrusion, and drop forging as well as in tube and glass manufacturing. Cold work tool steel. Cold work tool steel is one of the major types of tool steel. They are high carbon steels containing a smaller amount of manganese, tungsten, molybdenum, and chromium. 
They have good dimensional stability and hardenability. Cold work tool steel also has a high machinability. This is due to the presence of graphite and the lubrications it provides. Cold work tool steels are divided into three categories. Air hardening, A grade, oil hardening, O grade, and high carbon high chromium, D grade, tool steels. Cold work tool steels are typically used in the fabrication of larger parts or parts that require minimal distortion when hardened. Air hardening cold work tool steel. Air hardening cold work tool steel also known as A-grade tool steels are tool steels that are cooled in air. This type of tool steel has a carbon content of 0.6 to 1.4% and an alloying element of 5 to 10%. They have good dimensional stability and hardenability. The machinability of O-grade tool steel is quite good and has a good balance of toughness and wear resistance. The common applications of A-grade tool steel include blanking, coining, cold forming, cold swagging, cold trimming tools, gauges, etc. Oil hardening cold work tool steel. Oil hardening cold work tool steel also known as O-grade tool steel is a type of tool steel that is quenched by oil during production. Its carbon contents range from 0.9 to 1.45%. It has good abrasion resistance and toughness and is used in a variety of applications which include thread cutting, dye blanking, cold forming, cold trimming, gauges, etc. High Carbon High Chromium Tool Steel High Carbon High Chromium Cold Work Tool Steel is known as the D-type tool steel. They have a chromium content of 10 to 12%. Because of their high chromium content, D-grade tool steel is often also categorized as stainless. But the corrosion resistance is pretty low. They can maintain their hardness up to 425 degrees Celsius. This group of tool steels maintains a mix of W-grade and A-grade characteristics. Thus, they have high hardenability, low distortion, good high wear resistance, and they are good for long production runs. The common application of D-type includes die inserts, cold forming, cold shaping, thread roll, wire drawing, etc. High-speed tool steel. High-speed tool steel which is known as HSS or HS-grade, is commonly used as a cutting tool material. High-speed tool steel contains carbon of about 0.6%, 3 to 5% chromium, and 14 to 18% tungsten or molybdenum. Before the invention of high-speed tool steels, when cutting tools and machines worked for long periods, their efficiency decreased due to friction. High-speed tool steel does not lose its hardness at high temperatures making this a perfect use case for cutting. High-speed tool steels are divided into tungsten type, T-grade, and molybdenum type M grade. Common applications of high-speed tool steel include power saw blades, drill bits, milling cutters, gear cutters, router bits, etc. Special purpose tool steel. Special purpose tool steel is tool steel created for special purposes. Their special composition and qualities make them suitable for special applications that cannot be accomplished by water-hardened tool steel. And like the water-hardened tool steel, they are also water-quenched. Tool steels in this category contain high iron steels, while other alloying elements are either absent or present in minute quantities. The addition of these elements improves the high temperature performance and imparts some corrosion resistance. An example of special purpose tool steel is the low carbon L-type tool steel used in thermoplastic molding. The L-type tool steels are used where wear resistance and toughness are important. Applications of the low alloy special purpose tool steel include bearing, forging dies, die casting, file cutting, paper cutter, die bending, blanking and coining, clutch plates, wrenches, etc.